Hey there, I'm Baby Diva, and congratulations for successfully installing the game. Now get over yourselves and tell me how many people are playing. Oh, you're too kind. Oh, party of one. Well, we need your name before we can get going. See an icon you like? Pick it. Okay, your buzzer's gonna be the letter B. Okey-doke, let's go! Woohoo! All right, welcome to Head Rush. I'm Bob, and you are pathetic, playing by yourself. All right, whatever. So, here's the scoopage. Soon as you think you know the answer to a question, buzz in, then you have to hit a one, two, three, or four to make your choice. Got it? Good. Well, uh, if there's no further questions, let's start today's lesson. Category, please. The category? Chumba what? Huh? 10,000 bucks riding on this one. And we're off. Because he has the most experience with tubs, which Mother Goose character should appear in Chumbawamba's video for tub thumping? Wee Willy Winky, the Fiddler, the Candlestick Maker, or Humpty Dumpty? The three men who hung out in a tub were the Butcher, the Baker, and the Candlestick Maker. And why do I get the feeling that Mother Goose is going to be around a lot longer than Chumbawamba? I need a category. This baby is... I can't see you beneath all that makeup. And it's worth 20,000 bucks if you get this one right. Heads up, here it comes. If Beverly Hills 90210 star Tiffany Amber Thiessen comes out with a line of makeup made of actual amber, what will she be modeling? Tree sap lipstick, plastic rouge, wax eyeliner, or metal eyelashes? Amber is fossilized tree sap. And you know, I'll bet kissing a tree is just about as exciting as kissing Tiffany Amber Thiessen. Okay, pick a category. Looks like this category is totally tasteless jokes. Get it right, I'm handing over 20K. Hey, you know those totally tasteless jokes like what has no arms and no legs and hangs on the wall? And then the answer is art. Well, those are so horrible, I can't believe... Hey, how about this one? What do you call a Greek statue that has no arms and two legs? The Thinker, David, Venus de Milo, or Slippy? The Venus de Milo is a statue of Aphrodite, the Greek goddess of love. Unfortunately, her arms fell off a long time ago. Ha <laughs> ha, <laughs> <laughs> Venus, you are so lovely. Come embrace me in your loving arms. I, uh, I mean, uh, you're, uh, okay, I just pat you on your head. Bye-bye. All righty, pick one. H-E-A-D-B-U-T-T, -T, headbutt. H-E-A-D-B-U-T-T, H-E-A-D-B-U-T-T, -T, headbutt. One headbutt category coming up. Seasick heavenly bodies. Let's get the ball rolling at 50K for this headbutt question. Here's how to work the headbutt. You're going to see an equation like this one. All you got to do is figure out the parts and add them together. Let's see here. Paid athlete is pro. Littlest Hanson is Zach. Add them up. Pro Zach. Pretty simple, huh? Now, don't get nervous, but the more time you take, the less cash you get. All righty then. What does this equation add up to? Seafarer plus naked butt. What, you need some help? All right, the first... Let's see what you think. Start typing and then hit return. Uh. Yep, Sailor Moon. You know, she's got really big eyes. Eh, just wanted to throw that out there. Okay, I need a category. For your enjoyment, don't get fresh with me. 10,000 beanies if you get this one. Wipe off that finger, because here we go. Let's suppose that during a military coup, the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air becomes the Fresh Prince of Wales. Over which country will he rule? India, England, Jamaica, or Australia? <laughs> Wales is part of the United Kingdom, so the Fresh Prince is going to be heir to the throne of England. <laughs> which is great, because that'll give Carlton a reason to be a pompous ass. 
I need a category. This category is known as Greek mythology and casting couches. You get this one right, it's worth 30,000 greenbacks. Yeah, uh, you remember that MTV show Singled Out with Carmen Electra? If Carmen Electra auditioned for Singled Out by doing what Electra is famous for in Greek mythology, what would she most likely have said to get the job? I'd kill my own mother. I'd feed pigeons from my belly button. I'd put snakes in my hair. Or I'd like to ride a Trojan horse. <laughs> According to Greek mythology, Electra killed her own mother to avenge her father's death. Hey, Carmen, lighten up. You got the job. Okay, pick a category. All right, dude, you just picked a dis or dad. This dis or dad's category name is just plain goofy. Now, I'm gonna list seven items, and for each one, I want you to tell me if the full name of this product starts with magic or silly. As each one comes up, if it's a magic thing, press one. If it's a silly thing, press two. And a skip, press four. You get 5,000 for each right answer, and you lose 5,000 for a wrong answer or one you don't get to. Alrighty, bring out the monkey. Let's do it. Markers, magic or silly? Eight ball. Buddy. I. Rocks. String. Last one. Shell. That's all she wrote. You rock. You rock. You rock. Let's check out your score. Now that, my friend, does not suck. All right, what's next? Category, please. Hmm. Well, what do we have here? What kind of face cream do you use? This one can get you 10 grand. Hey, uh, you ever hear of that acne medication called Retin-A? Yeah, sure you haven't. If you're so stupid that you rub Retin-A all over your Retin-A, what will you be doing? Preventing blemishes on your ears, preventing pimples inside your brain, preventing zits on your eyeballs, or preventing blackheads on your backside. You'd be rubbing zit cream on your retinas, which are part of your eyeballs. You know what they say about zits on your eyeballs. Nobody can see them but you. Okay, I need a category. This one's called, Blood is Alan Thick or Than Water. 20,000 bucks for a correct answer. Hey, remember that show Growing Pains where the dad was a psychiatrist who worked at home? Whoa, that's a funny one. Anyway. Say Growing Pains dad, Jason Seaver, diagnoses his son Mike as having an Oedipal complex. What has Mike been doing? Sending love poems to his mom Maggie, staring at his sister Carol's feet, spreading gossip about his brother Ben, or failing all his classes at school. Oedipus was the guy who killed his father and fell in love with his mother. If you're a boy who's real close to his mother, I mean really close, they say you have an Oedipal complex. But hey, if my mom looked like Maggie Seaver, I might be tempted to marry her too. Ah, uh, no, that's pretty weird. Nah, I'd probably just date her for a while. Alrighty, pick one. The category is, he'll make a delicious cookie someday. And we got 30,000 bucks in the pot. Hey, you know that little white naked guy, the Pillsbury Doughboy? Well, if the Pillsbury Doughboy were one of the original Doughboys, what would you most likely see poking him in the stomach at the end of his commercials? A large drill, a bass guitar, a linebacker's helmet, or a German bayonet? The term doughboy refers to American soldiers who fought in World War I, so the Pillsbury Doughboy would most likely take a German bayonet in the tummy. <laughs> that is your cute little laugh now, doughboy! I need a category. We'll be right back to the game after this commercial break. Oh, where's my scrunchie? It was right here. In a rush. Try new triple lip eyeshadow deodorant lip gloss all in one. On the run, get three in one. Swoosh swipes me and the choice is totally clear. <laughs> 
But if I think you're wrong, you owe me 5,000. Oh, yes, and let's not forget. Remember the clue! Your match better fit this clue. We are on a first name basis, and I'd really like to think we are. Why don't you call me Mr. Bob? Good luck! Congratulations, my friend. You made it through an entire game by yourself, and you came out on top. You know, not many people can say that. But, yeah, they can. Oh, well. Thanks for playing. Bye. And cut. Okay, Baby Diva, what's going on? They going again or what? Oh, wow, you got on the high scoreboard. That is so cool. Too bad it was empty. Just let me know. For the first time, I turn around and throw up on the carpet. Oh, God. I'm not cleaning that up. Like, what happened? Well, I don't want to talk about it. No, seriously, tell me. You know, it just, once it wants to come back up, yeah. there's, ain't no stopping it. Was she kissing so. him when it happened? Or? I don't think she was kissing him. Okay. And then I look around and everyone would stop what they were doing and they were staring at me. Get away from me. And from the site of this devastating tornado, we have our on-location correspondent, Benjamin Lockhart. Benjamin? It's incredible the devastation that there is in this place. I can't even believe the sight I've seen. Uh, Benjamin? Yes? Are you just crumpling a piece of paper in front of the microphone again? I couldn't afford a bus ticket. Back to you, Bruce. Mira, es el plátano con el paraguas. Oh oh, el plátano está buscando amor. Ay, pobre plátano. So you, you ever had anything like really embarrassing happen to you? Oh, yeah. I couldn't figure out why I didn't know them, but I thought I don't want to be rude, so I'll just wave back, you know? You know, for like a whole block, people seemed to be that a lot of people knew me that day, because right. there were a lot of people pointing. So I'm waving and smiling, walking, having a great time, right? Uh -huh. And I caught my reflection in the window uh, of a star, and my skirt was underneath my backpack. I mean, like your whole butt was like hanging out? Oh, yeah. Out. Completely. <laughs> Completely. Ouija boards? Oh, yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah, it's Ouija boards. B. I. T. E. M. E. Hey! Go get some coffee. This may take a while. You know, I don't... Would it be a really bad thing if I just belched? I think you should. I really feel like I'm going to any second. Like throw up your hand or something if it's coming. I belched the other night because I was about to kiss him. For some reason, he didn't Well, that's not exactly the that. moment you want the belch. Right, right. And then it hits that point where it feels like it might be vomit instead, so you kind of... <laughs> you've got a bail. <laughs> I think Chris was upset when you burped in his face. 